explain once again that the Congress of the United States on occasion is, is bipartisan. But we came together last night. We came together united as the House of Representatives. And we seized an opportunity to right a shameful wrong. You know, I'm a daughter of, a, of an immigrant parent, so I know full well the stories. I know his courage, his hope, his determination, and his hard work. But most of all, I know of his incredible love for this country. And that is the story of every immigrant who comes to our shores. The Chinese were good enough to work to build the railroad, but then they were demonized. And I must say that in my very district, the internment of Japanese Americans occurred at Tan Fran Park and right outside my district at Angel Island, uh, Chinese immigrants were detained and oftentimes uh, deported. The good news is that um, one of our towns is named Burlingame after the minister to China, whose name was Burlingame, who actually created the, the Burlingame Treaty, which encouraged Chinese to immigrate to the United States and protected them against uh, discrimination as well. So I, I would like to just close by saying how proud I am to, to join in this effort, uh, but to also point out that there is more good news ahead. This is the San Francisco Chronicle today. And in the San Francisco Chronicle today, the headline reads on the front page, Asian Americans on top. <laughs> Group has highest incomes, is best educated, and the happiest. So, uh, <laughs> a long way uh, to that uh, headline, but I'm uh, grateful to be here. Now, Congress Member Ed Royce. 